Hey guys, Christina Murray here with a special themed haul for you. Books and makeup. Um, I don't know if you guys know this, and maybe you do, but you don't understand the ex extent of how true this is. But I am a fangirl. I am a professional fangirl. I own up to it. Is this the right way to, whatever, I own it. I am proud of it. I am in complete denial that sometimes I could come off as a little bit crazed. But with that being said, I don't care. I am happy in my fandom. I am happy in my fangirl ways. I am completely enamored with the Mortal Instruments. For those of you that don't know what that is, you should probably stop watching this video because there is, there is a whole other world out there, my friend, that you are not aware of. You should probably brush up on it. But luckily for you, I am going to help you because I have a haul and it all has to do with the Mortal Instruments. Basically, it is a series of six novels written by Cassandra Clare about the world of mundanes and shadow hunters and warlocks and werewolves and vampires and oh my and Herondales and Waylands and Freys and Lightwoods okay I'm done it's an amazing amazing young adult series and there's a prequel to the Mortal Instruments called the Infernal Devices and then there is a sequel to the Mortal Instruments called the Dark Artifices, which aren't out yet, but the Infernal Devices are. And I, I, I can't get enough of it. Anyway, the first movie called The City of Bones for the Mortal Instruments is coming out in August. The premiere is on August 12th in LA and I am going to try my damnedest, yes I cursed, to get out there to see this premiere to be a part of that community oh okay but let me get to the haul sorry most of it is books most of it is books but I have one makeup item and I'm pretty sure you can you can guess what it is since it's one makeup item but okay so the first thing I got yesterday or today is Wednesday so yes yesterday the Mortal Instruments Companion by Lois H. Gresh was released and I got this and I am so excited to just read through this. It just further discusses all of the big bad themes of the mortal instruments, even the infernal devices, um, from the relationships to the bad guys, to what angels and shadow hunters are, to what the mortal instruments are, to everything. And I cannot wait to read this. I just, <sighs> okay, moving on. I got the box set of all five books. Remember I said six books, but the sixth one isn't out yet. So yeah, here's the first one. The City of Bones, City of Ashes, City of Glass, City of Fallen Angels, City of Lost Souls. And I cannot be happier. They're all hardback and it's funny because I hate hardback, book, hardback books, but these are going to be collector's items for me. I collected Harry Potter novels, I collected both the American hardback and the UK hardback, so I have those both. And then I'm going to also purchase the newly designed covers that have recently been shown. So I'm going to be buying those too when they come out. So, oh, I need a library in this house. I have two spare rooms downstairs. One is gonna become a library, just watch. Then I also got The Infernal Devices, and there's only three books in this. So this is, is this upside down? No, so this is all three. Clockwork Angel, Clockwork Prince, Clockwork Princess. Oh. And then the f only makeup item that I got is this Parallel Worlds Makeup Collection by NYX inspired by the Mortal Instruments City of Bones. I'm not going to open it because it's just too pretty for me to open right now, but I will let you know what's on the inside as per the bottom. This is what's on the inside. An eyeshadow palette, um, a matte lip cream, a mascara, a powder blush, a studio liquid liner, and a jumbo eye pencil. So that's what's inside, and you can see it's taped. I'm going to preserve this slip. I don't want it 
to get ruined and you can kind of see it has a little knob on it where you can just hold it and then it has here on the slip like this is the this is the city that <sighs> I'm just really really excited about the series I haven't been this excited about something since Harry Potter and I obsessed over Harry Potter when I was in high school and college obsessed over it like it was borderline unhealthy how in love I was with Draco Malfoy I'm not even kidding it's it's ridiculous I shipped Draco and Hermione so bad in high school and in college like I don't even know there was no possible way for those two to get together in these novels but I shipped them so hard in the mortal instruments Jason Clary oh, but then Alec and Magnus so Clace and Malik I oh that's it that's my haul that's everything I got I am sorry no I am not sorry sorry I'm not sorry hashtag sorry I'm not sorry I am just so excited for this series I'm so excited for it to be brought to the film to the movies I am so excited to see Jamie as Jace I'm excited to see Lily as Clary I'm just oh, And then Robert Sheehan, I didn't know he was that hot. Oh my gosh. So, uh, that's another video. I'm going to stop. That was my haul. That's everything. If you want to know any more about my love for Mortal Instruments, give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe. Just let me know that <laughs> you want to know more about my love. You want to know more about what I mean when I say I'm a professional fangirl. Because I am. And I will see you guys in my next video. If I look sweaty, it's because it's freaking a million degrees out right now. You hear my fan going because I don't want to turn on my air conditioning. But yeah, so I, I apologize if I look a little sweaty. But I will talk to you guys soon. My hair is a freaking mess. But bye guys.